Start then. Do you do drugs? No. <laughs> mm, right now I'm taking antibacterial eye cream, <laughs> multivitamin, <laughs> clay. 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 I'm taking clay. How come clay? Clay cleanses you. And if you take it every day, it gives your body a lot of minerals which you can absorb into your system because it's an all natural source of minerals so it makes you stronger. Your hair is uh, touching the microphone. Yeah. Is it making a oh. sound? I can hear it, yeah. <clears throat> Better? Maybe you can point it a little bit towards your mouth. Oh, stupid shirt. Smelly shirt. Avastamone, the only drugs that we do are antibiotics. Shit! <laughs> <laughs> of antibiotics because we're always sick. I have asthma and usually I'm in some state of bronchitis. Um, so actually the most healthy person is now sick. How come? Mm, she's actually also taking antibiotics. Always. I actually, what happens to us is that when we're on tour, we, we don't get really get to sleep very much when we're traveling a lot. So um, it can be really hard to stay healthy when you have to play two shows in one night Go to sleep at one, wake up at three, catch a flight to Milan, and then, you know, you're just like running, 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 and then you never get to rest. Interviews all day. But do you have, don't you have a tour bus? Or? We have a van, a tour van. Tour van. We're using this company called Fluff Wheels, which is amazing. We have the best van of all time because it's huge and has a loft bed. And so... So it's kind of like a bus because you can sleep on it, mm -hmm. but we're only in three piece and we... There's only five people in our crew, including the driver, so you don't really need a boss. Yeah. It's really nice. Hey, the Decemberists are playing tonight, and we're really excited because we like them. Okay. Um, well, it's been uh, your second album now, the new one, The World of Music. Mm -hmm. um, but I was wondering, how do you, what are your thoughts on um, Verses of Comfort? If you look back on it now, it's been two years. Yeah. Even longer than two years, I think. Yeah, I yeah. mean, okay. So the release was in 2005. Well, Verses was really a collection of songs that, um, after we had been playing for a while and we wrote a bunch of songs, and we thought, oh, we should maybe record some of the songs that we've written. So it's a collection of like how the come? best songs. I mean, how come, how come we thought, well, maybe we well, should record these songs? Because we had started playing a lot of shows around New York, and so it just seemed kind of obvious. Yeah, like, it started out as a demo. Yeah. And then we were like, well, we started playing shows. We were like, well, let's play in better clubs, and the only way to play in better clubs is to have a demo. So we recorded the demo, and then this Japanese record label, Rally Records, was contacted us, and they said, hey, can we put out your CD? And we are like, well, hmm. We have five songs, let's just write three more and then we'll make, give it to them as a record. So that's how that record actually happened, because we had a deadline and we made it. But how come the Japanese label got onto your music? How come? I don't know. We played mm -hmm. with a band called Certainly Sir, who is also on the label. Mm -hmm. um, and Fumi, who, I'm sorry, Fumi, who runs the label, uh, he basically goes on the internet all day to find new bands. So when he saw the Certainly Sir was playing a show, he found our music and offered us a deal. And yeah. he's brought us to Japan twice already to tour, so we're really excited about it. And we're going back in the summer too, so we'll be our third time. So we're really happy about that. You mean touring in Japan? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. 